Hi, I'm Mark Holdaway, and this is a first lesson for the Celtic D Karimba. Now I'm going to ask you to mark up your kalimba with Sharpie markers, and just to prove it's going to be okay, I'm cleaning up after my previous attempt at this video. So this is an alcohol wipe. You can use spit and fingernails, but alcohol wipes do a better job. Now instead of teaching you Celtic music on the Celtic D, I'm going to show you what this kalimba does most easily, and that's going from D major to E minor. And I'm going to ask you to get green and red Sharpie markers, the green on the D chord, one, three, five, and then one, three, five, an octave higher. I'm going to throw in the major seven for good measure. Now your job is to just color within the lines. So there's a lot you can do with just those notes. It makes the kalimba a lot easier to think about, for one, but you will get tired of playing just those notes, which is why God invented red Sharpie markers. So I'm going here. That's the E note. This is the E minor chord. I'm going to throw in the minor seventh for good measure. Let's just explore on red. You can play those notes in any old order, but those are the most important notes because those are E, the names of the notes that the chord was named after. So maybe come back to that note. But of course, you'll get bored and you'll want to go to green. Switch. And back. So there's lots of things you can do in this universe with just two colors. 